आज हमारे लिए बड़े गर्व की बात है कि दुनिया के बड़े बड़े लीडर्स दिल्ली में स्वास्थ्य के क्षेत्र में जो क्रांति हो रही है उसको खुद देखने के लिए आए हैं दूर दूर से आज हमारे साथ हैं नॉर्वे की पूर्व प्रधानमंत्री दो बार प्रधानमंत्री रह चुकी हैं मिसेस ग्रो हार्लिम एक बार जोरदार तालियों से उनका स्वागत करते हैं आज हमारे साथ हैं यूएन के फॉर्मर सेक्रेटरी जनरल श्री बून की मान बैबान की मोन उनका हम कले दिल से स्वागत करते हैं अभी हमने उनको एक मोहल्ला क्लिनिक जो दिल्ली का सबसे पहला मोहल्ला क्लिनिक था वो दिखाया उसके बाद हम लोगों ने उनको पॉली क्लिनिक दिखाया और सारा समझाया उसके बाद सीधे हम उनको प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस में लेके आ रहे हैं तो वो हमें बताएंगे उनको कैसा लगा आई जस्ट इंट्रोड्यूस बोथ ऑफ यू टू द मीडिया एंड ऑफ कोर्स आई यू बोथ ऑफ यू डोंट नीड एन इंट्रोडक्शन एंड आई जस्ट टोल्ड एम दैट यू हैव विजिटेड आर मोहल्ला क्लिनिक एंड पॉली क्लिनिक एंड नाउ वी रिक्वेस्ट बोथ ऑफ यू टू शेयर योर एक्सपीरियंस Uh, good morning. It is uh, great to be here today with the Chief Minister and the Health Minister. Um, having seen how impressive work is being done for the citizens of this city and of course everyone who reaches to the Mahalla Clinic and to the Public Clinic. We are working as elders to try to support universal health coverage across the world. And in India, you are at the moment far from it. However, here in Delhi, with the Mahala clinics and the plans to develop them, you are approaching what needs to be done for all people, for every Indian and for everyone in every country. So we are very happy to see what is done here in Delhi and what the government has been planning and implementing on behalf of the people uh, of this region. It needs to happen all over India. Namaste. Uh, it's a great honor for me to return to India where I served a long time ago as a diplomat. And I'm also uh, very pleased to return as a member of the elders and as a former Secretary General of the United Nations. While working at the United Nations, I have traveled many places to make sure that everybody gets proper health service so that there be nobody left behind. I am deeply touched and impressed by what the government of India and particularly this New Delhi Chief Minister uh, Honorable Arvind uh, Kedriwan uh, has a great vision uh, to make sure that all primary health care service is given uh, to uh, poor and vulnerable people. Mohalla Clinic and this Polya Clinic are good examples how governments and political leaders can do for the people. I deeply appreciate uh, Mr. Chief Minister and also uh, Health Minister Chai uh, for all their hard work and very compassionate, uh, compassionate leadership for the people. This is exactly what we expect the Prime Minister Modi 
will continue to do much more. We commend the Prime Minister Modi and Government of India's commitment to bring universal health care service to India and at the same time this uh, national health policy of 2017 tackling social determinants of weak and vulnerable people. But at the same time we expect that government will do more uh, to bring all the people together and receiving all necessary medical support. And thank you very much. I wish you all the best. Thank you. So he is asking that uh, you have faced so many problems in setting up these clinics. So do they know about this? No, he is asking me. Do they know about these problems that you have faced in setting up these clinics? इनसे कल काफी लंबी बात हुई थी और इन लोगों को I'm telling them that yes last night we had a dinner and in that I explained them how there were several political interventions and obstructions that were created in setting up this these mohalla clinics but now we have already set up 189 mohalla clinics for the last two and a half years we could not do any work because of several obstructions. But now after the Supreme Court judgment, now we are confident that we will be able to set up about 1000 Mohalla clinics in the next few months. Definitely, I am very much impressed by what I have seen today. I have traveled to many, many places. In Africa, in Africa, not many people have uh, access even to what is known as a health post. Health post. It's a minimal service. Then they go to clinics. Then, if anybody is lucky, they may be able to visit the hospital. There's a health post, but there's just one, one person just providing some information and basic medicines, clinics. But what I have seen today in a polyclinic is much systematic, well organized, well treated. I am very much impressed, and also Moala Clinic, that's the place where a lot of uh, vulnerable and poor people are living. And again, with the strong engagement of Chief Minister and Health Minister, and I think that they are well taken care of. I hope uh, there will be much, much more support and strong engagement at the union government level under the leadership of Prime Minister Modi. And we have already spoken out uh, many times that uh, this 1% uh, of GDP budgetary support uh, should be increased by, uh, by 2021 20, instead of 2025 uh, to the level of 2.5% of um, uh, GDP. India is number seven the biggest economy in the world. We should be proud. And then, as much as that, I think they commensurate, commensurate with economic development, there should be much more support for the people. The government should be people-centered policy. And I appreciate the State Chief Minister. Uh, I, uh, to add to um, what my colleague has said is that 
we have seen that the Mohalla Clinic is uh, securing prevention and health promotion, not only treatment. This is very important that nutrition, childhood immunization, pregnancy uh, attendance, you know, maternal and child health. It has to be preventive and promotion of health from the early days of a pregnancy until a child grows up. And they have 100% immunization levels, which is impressive, and it should be like this all over the world. And as Ban Ki Moon just said, uh, you have countries in this region of South Asia which uh, have the same kind of level of economic development, but they have much more attention to the public health service. And they are spending more of their GDP for improving health. Which means it can be done in India as well. It has been done in your neighboring countries. It has been done in China. And uh, I am hopeful, as we have just uh, expressed, that Prime Minister Modi, with his plans, will also raise the level of attention in the broader total India. And there are examples here to be followed. Thank you. I just want to share that Delhi government has almost doubled its uh, expenditure on health. Uh, when they took over, there was less than 6% of the budget was being spent on health. Now we are spending more than 12% of our budget on health. Sir, the question is, is there a lot of that is not the problem. They are saying that the government should also increase their budget for the country. Like the Delhi government has also increased the budget in Delhi and has done so much work on health care. This work should be done in the whole country. And the government should also increase the GDP from 1% to 2.5% in the country. What is the problem with the health care? The government has also increased the health care. The government has also increased the health care. अब जैसे इनका ये मानना है कि मोहल्ला क्लिनिक को जगह जगह पहुंचना चाहिए लेकिन जैसा आप लोग देख रहे हैं कि अब तेलंगाना में कर्नाटका में आंध्र प्रदेश में उन्होंने मोहल्ला क्लिनिक ऑलरेडी बनाने चालू कर दिए हैं और कई दूसरी सरकारें इसके ऊपर इंटरेस्ट ले रही हैं तो अच्छी बात है पूरे देश के अंदर जरूरत पड़ेगी तो सरकार को भी आप लोग दुआ करेंगे और मिले ताकि आप लोग हमें कोई बजट नहीं चाहिए हमें काम करने से यही बहुत है I said that uh, he asked me, do you need more budget from the central government? I said, I don't need budget. Please ask them to allow us to work. That's all we want. Yes. Thank you so much.